All right. So, in order to flip the button on the XOK, you will need two Torx T8 bits, or bit drivers, or whatever. Um, what ends up happening is if you try to unscrew one side or the other, it just freely spins. So, So one side's being held. All you gotta do is break it open. Now, the button part that sticks out, you wanna make sure you don't lose that washer or that spring. Okay, and then the other side will have your screw, so you might just have to pop that out. And that comes out separately too. Okay, so whatever side you want to switch it to, um, shouldn't matter. Like I said, normally it's set up for your thumb to be over here. Um, but I'm just going to put it back the way that I had it, which was switched. So this is now your new button side, right? And then all you got to do is uh, screw it down. Of this spinning it again. And just to make sure it's all secured, just give it a little snug. And uh, that's it. Oh. <laughs> Terrible opening, but whatever. Who gives a shit? Alright, cool. There you go.